everyone, I'm Amy Booth and welcome back to the Blue Rose Kennels YouTube channel sponsored by Canine Chronicle TV. As promised, I have worked on a video for you on how to go shopping if you're a lady and you're looking for clothing with pockets and how to do it on a budget. So stay tuned. Welcome back and thank you for joining us. Today I'm going to take you to eBay and give you some of the search engines, some of the filters, some of the little tricks that I do in eBay to find suits with pockets, sundresses with pockets, find the right lengths, find your sizes, and the colors that you're looking for. So come on, let's go shopping. Okay, although I have a few different searches already saved within eBay for different types of clothing that I personally like to look out for, I'm going to start you from scratch and take you from the beginning. So we're going to go into the eBay search bar here and we're going to type in women's suits with pockets. And you're going to see a bunch of different suits pop up on your screen. Now you're going to go to the left hand side and search for sizes. I like to average around a four and a six right now in suits when I'm looking. So I'm going to select both size four and size six. So I narrow down my search. And you can also scroll down here and do your shipping preferences, your condition, do you want it new or do you want it used? All different types of selections on the left hand side of your screen. Okay, so as you can see on the screen now, I have narrowed it down to a regular size, women's six, women's four. Anyway, as you scroll through the page, you'll see different types of beautiful suits. You see a St. John here, and a St. John here, a Le suit here, and the prices vary. The other thing that you can see is if you can do a best offer on an item. So they might be asking for $224.99, but you can go in on that item and offer something less and see if they accept it. That's a huge selling point in my opinion. Oftentimes I've bid a very low number and I've actually won it. But look at all these suits on this page that have pockets. Very cute, White House Black Market, Tahari, Linda Allard, Theory, Talbots. So the prices can't be beat and you can choose whether you're buying new or used. Since we're showing dogs and we're looking at suits, I just try to leave that option open. I read the description or the condition of the items and if the items look like they're in pretty good shape, I'll go ahead and buy it if it's at a discounted price. Because remember, we are dealing with dogs, we want to look sharp, but anything that you wear is going to get worn out a lot faster with all that we do with animals. A lot of the items can be bid on and you can watch for the date that the auction closes and I also set triggers in my phone so it, it allows me to know the sale on this item is about to end so do I want to purchase it or is the price now out of my budget? You also want to watch your shipping fees because sometimes an item will say it's a certain dollar amount but the shipping fee takes it up even higher. So sometimes you can use the filters on the side to set shipping as free if that's what you'd like. So again, double check these options on the side for your sizes, your cuts, the colors that you're looking for if you have a particular color in mind, if you want a skirt suit, a uh, suit with a jacket and blazer. You can also type in pantsuit if you're looking for a pantsuit, which all the time I'm preferring more and more. If you'd like to limit the search by the brand name, there's an option to do that as well. Here's where you can select used or new, and here's where you can select free shipping. 
Do your research on the seller that you're buying from. See what kind of grade they have as a seller, if they're a reliable source to buy from. So suits may be easier to find with pockets, but how about sundresses? Here's my tips on trying to find a good sundress with pockets. Just change your search engine to sundress with pockets. Again, make sure you go into the filter and change the sizes to what you're looking for. I usually put two sizes in because depending on the brand name, I might fit in one size or the other. That's why I say it's a great tip to go into department stores, try on suits, so you know how the different brand names fit on you before you purchase online. Also, because it's a sundress, make sure you set it as a midi. You want that midi length for a sundress because remember, in showing dogs, you're gonna be bending over. And when you have a one piece type of an outfit on, every time you bend over, it's going to pull the back of your skirt up and we don't wanna be showing anything from behind. So the midi length is the length that I recommend for dog show sundresses. So under the sundress category, you have to be really careful in your selections because some of them converge on not being business type appropriate for dog shows. That's why I recommend just putting in dress with pockets. So let's get rid of the word sun and search again. Again, because it's a new search and we didn't save it, you're gonna need to save your sizes again and then select your dress length as midi and you'll start seeing some search items that are a little bit more appropriate. I've also used the search business dress with pockets. Again, put in your sizes. And that length being a midi. And you can see that it's really starting to get more and more acceptable for dog show wear with pockets. How about this London Times with pockets for $14.88? Say I'm looking for a St. John knit. Simply type that up in your search. and adjust your sizes. Again, you can put a price range in here if you're looking for St. John's on a budget, but don't forget, you can also bid low on some items and get them at a lesser price. For example, this St. John collection suit of $179.95 or best offer. So I can click on it. I can either buy it now for the $179.95 or um, make an offer on it and lowball it to whatever you feel comfortable with and your offer will expire in one day you send it in and you see if they'll take that lesser offer but as I pull up this suit I want you to also make sure you see that it says no returns there's 17 other people watching it and the seller's information has a uh, 1,103 score of stars, 100% positive feedback. So this is someone that I would trust to buy a suit from. Okay, so I looked at that suit, I liked it. I'm not ready to buy right now, but I wanna save this search for a future day. I wanna know uh, that I don't have to type it in every time and change my settings or add in my filters. I just wanna save it. Right here, you can see, you can select save this search and then it will be stored in your eBay file every time you log in. For example, for me, I have up here my watch list. These are items that I'm currently looking at. Look at, I found an Ann Taylor gingham checked skirt with pockets that I paired this red top with and the combined price down low. I found an Ann Taylor plaid uh, pocket flare dress for 
some other outfits that I kind of have my eye on. So when I click right here, it tells me what's in my watch list. If I click right here, my eBay, it tells me what I've recently viewed, what I've bid on, and what's the status of my bids, and if the offers have been accepted. My watch list that I showed you from this screen right here. My purchase history, which I am not gonna click on and show you. <laughs> And down here is my saved searches, which if I saved this search right here for St. John Knit Suit, and it says saved, it will now appear when I click on saved searches, which you can see I have a variety of different ways that I personally have saved my searches. Once you save these searches, you can also have it update you with emails or text messages and it lets you know when new items under that search have been entered into that description. So I have all of my eBay emails turned off and when I have time, I come in and check them myself. Now I like to do my eBay shopping on my phone and the display on your phone is going to appear a bit different than it does on the computer. I just thought it was going to be easier to show you on a computer screen. So just note there are going to be some adjustments when you do eBay shop on your phone. I hope this has given you a little bit of an intro to eBay shopping for suits, sundresses, skirts, anything with pockets. That's my tip for finding the best pocket wear for women. Now let me show you a really quick guide for finding affordable and comfortable dog show shoes. The best deals I've found are on Amazon. So let me switch the screen from eBay to Amazon and the brand that I recommend the most on a consistent basis is Lifestride. It's a middle of the road price range. It has good basic flats with a rubber sole it has a decent amount of cushion on them and they're affordable so if they start to wear out you can easily replace them. All I did was type in Life Stride Flats for Women and as you can see the different types of shoes, even one with a patent leather toe that you know is kind of me, comes in different colors so you can match your suits easily. I hope this quick start guide on the intro to budget shopping for clothes with pockets for women as well as comfortable and affordable shoes was helpful. Comment in the box below if you'd like more tips on how to shop and save money. If you like what we're doing on our channel, please subscribe, like this video, set the bell to be notified anytime we upload new content, and share this channel with anyone you think might like it. Bye for now, and we'll see you in our next video.